the last 40 years since the widespread adoption of factory farming. The world has lost half of its wildlife, half of all the birds, half of all the mammals, the reptiles, the amphibians, the fish, gone. We do need bloody noses before collectively we start modifying systems. I have very clearly come to conclude that our present agricultural policies are not sustainable. How much of our resources can we use without jeopardizing the earth as a living space for us? We're running close to the limit. There's nothing more fundamental to human well-being now and in the future than the health of soils and yet this is becoming a global crisis according to many close to the data. There's no one silver bullet that can be fired at this. We need to be looking at the whole thing at once. Literally a holistic approach. The current consumption of uh, red meat is, uh, is too high. People should move away from a meat-based dietary pattern. We can all help through our food choices three times a day by eating plants, by eating less and better meat from pasture-fed, free-range or organic systems. When you see animals that are part of a sustainable and robust agroecological system, that is inherently more dignified both for the animal and for the farming community. Saying to business, you're an agent for change. We want to work with you to make it a good change. Good for people, good for the planet. Factory farming, for example, is the biggest instigators of new infectious diseases. We've devised a distorting economics, including the detrimental impact of industrial agriculture on health, wildlife and natural resources. But if we're really going to secure the future for our children, we're also going to need something more something akin to that UN Framework Convention on Climate Change. Let's make change happen. Let's change what's on our plate. We share the world with many different species who all have equivalent claim to existence as do human beings. We have to see if we are capable of simply loving them enough to let them live and continue to live on Earth with us.